Good morning from Marca. We are about to head out for today's trek. It's day three. Here is Mark coming over the bridge from our campsite. And Marka will be a bit further up the hill, right Mark? Where is your Marka town? Village? It's not yes. much of a town, 150 population, it's up there on the hill. And we should walk past the school with five pupils. Our friend Dolma, Dolma's school. That was a bit vigorous uh, spinning. <laughs> the more vigorous, the better. More prize. Where are we here? <laughs> this is Hanka Village. In the Marker Valley. Sorry, no, it's not Hanka Village, it's Marker Village in the Marker Valley. The capital of Marker, or the Marker Valley, 150 inhabitants. A uh, little school with five people, and then as you can see, lots of Buddhist prayer wheels, walls, prayer flags, stupas, etc. Very holy place. Okay, let's take a, a look. Yeah, okay. <laughs> let's go around. Itself is very fertile, lots of crops, mostly wheat. I think this is something else though. Um, and you can see in the distance there's lots of willow and poplar groves, so it's very fertile in the valley floor, but dry and barren above. Okay, <laughs> okay. Are you done? <laughs> Santos just putting his shoes on. We just waded across here. No bridge, so just socks off. Kept my shoes on because it's quite rocky on the bottom and just just waded across. Easier for the horses. Little cutie, little cutie. 
quickly. Oh. Ooh, ooh. And this here, at the end of the valley, is our first view of Kanyatse. Uh, and Santosh tells us that big glacier is Kanyatse 2, and you can just about see Kanyatse 1 the other side, just past it. Um, Santosh tells us this is the back side, and we're going up the other side. So, um, not that way. But yeah, nice to get first sight of it from the Marker Valley. That's Imran's bag. There we go, that's right, that's right. Uh, <laughs> Not so heavy, it's just only 10 to 12 kgs. Look! <laughs> no Not so heavy, it's just 18, 10 to 12 kgs. That's not too bad. Don't drink it. I have a little scratch. A little scratch. Yeah, that's, that's it. There we go. So this is our campsite at Hanka. The Marka Valley is going up that way. Where it's about 3,950 meters. Um, it's in shade now. It's about 4:30 when we arrived at two o'clock. There's no shade at all. It was very sunny. It's these very small willows. Um, but yeah, no shade. But now 4.30, it's, it's all in shade. All the sun has gone behind that mountain up there. Um, but otherwise, it's a pleasantish spot. Probably not nice as nice as the last two campsites, but we've been spoilt. Horses there. And this, this horse here is, is the prince. Those ones have to get me tied up there. But this one here gets to graze on its own, wander around because it's the um, belongs to the owner. It doesn't carry any luggage. It just wanders around with the owner, carries the owner from time to time. Our tent is down here. Adita is inside getting um, well, just, just doing a few bits and pieces. And we have these camp chairs and some, some tea. It's very nice. <laughs> 